Is it true that you can leap over a chair from a standing position? It depends on the size of the chair. Much like Bill Gates leaping over a chair in 1994, the current Apple versus FBI encryption debate is confusing and lacks context. Is there a reason they can't just take the shooter's phone, do some whatever they do? Magic. People are asking a lot of questions. Namely, what the hell is going on? In the Apple versus FBI debate, a majority of people have sided with the FBI but 11% of people are still undecided. So what's myth and what's fact? Bill Gates has sided with the FBI. Myth. Despite several sources reporting that Bill Gates is Team FBI, he's publicly stated that he's more neutral. I came in this morning and saw headlines saying Bill Gates backs FBI. Wait. Yeah, I was disappointed because that doesn't state my view on this. While Facebook and Google are siding with Apple. We're sympathetic with Apple on this one. Gates says the issue isn't black and white. I do believe there are sets of safeguards where the government shouldn't have to be completely blind. All the FBI wants is access to one phone. Myth. The FBI wants access to all phones. Also myth. It's more nuanced than that. The general fear is that accessing one phone could lead to Orwellian surveillance or some other kind of evildoer. Bad shit could happen if this falls into the wrong hand. But what the FBI really wants is a system put in place that would allow them to access devices in the future when they have a legal, legitimate law enforcement concern. But that scares people because it sets a new precedent. Precedent. Unprecedented. Precedent. Precedent. Apple is the good guy, and FBI is the bad guy. Myth. Neither is definitively good or bad. Both are exercising their rights under the law, and until this gets through court, it's essentially a battle of the brands. The FBI, whose brand is protection, say they don't want to break anyone's encryption or set a master key loose in the land, while Apple, whose brand is privacy, says it would be the equivalent of a master key capable of opening hundreds of millions of locks. Whether you're Team Apple or Team FBI, one big takeaway is that this debate was made public on purpose. The FBI could have settled the case with Apple privately, which they've done in the past, but they decided to break the fourth wall to appeal to us for support. Apple wants you to remain skeptical of big government. We shall prevail. 1984 won't be like 1984. But the government wants you to turn against Apple which some people already have. What I think you ought to do is boycott Apple. How do you like that? I just thought it. What's important is that you don't jump to conclusions too quickly. This is your mic check.